Yes, in court we learned that this all started when one of the men senten sentenced today dropped about 80 bucks outside a store in Detroit. A 13-year-old boy picked it up and pocketed it in retaliation. That man and another woman kidnapped and killed him. We first showed you 13-year-old Deontay Mitchell's face when police issued an Amber Alert. Deontay could be seen on surveillance video being forced into a car outside a market on Detroit's east side. He would be found too late in a field near Harper and Baldwin in Detroit. The Wayne County Medical Examiner said he had been tortured and strangled. I apologize for being here and uh, being here. Yeah, for having you here, wasting the court's time for the, this matter. This is Lillian Roberts, who pleaded guilty to second degree murder and kidnapping for taking and killing the 13 year old boy. And I, I would like to apologize to the Mitchell family just for my involvement. Those are the words she said to the judge just before the 44 year old mom learned her sentence today. You're leaving it up to me. I'll just leave it to 24 to 40. Uh, for unlawful imprisonment, Judge? Well, it's concurrent with the murder. I would just like to say I'm sorry to the family. Also sentenced, her 45 year old boyfriend, Gregory Walker, to at least 40 years in prison. No less than 40 years and no more than 60 years. This man, Ernest Coleman, was also sentenced to at least 12 years in prison for torturing the boy. His sentencing happened earlier this month. Deontay's mom was in the courtroom during the sentencing, but she declined the opportunity to speak to the judge about the senseless murder of her son. Reporting live, Kim Russell, 7 Action News.